Welcome to PD on your plan. My name is Mr. Flores. I'll be your instructor today, and if you have any questions, just raise your hand by emailing me or following me on Twitter. In today's lesson, we're going to study jabs. This is a fundamental close reading skill. So I'll introduce, I'll so say like, you got to practice your name? Yeah, <laughs> okay. So I'm going to say, my name is Kiana. I'm in the eighth grade, and I go to Irving Middle School. Is that in the practice work? Yes, okay. Good. Hey everybody, so I'm here to talk about the fundamentals and I'm at one of my favorite classrooms ever, Conan's Academy in Norman, Oklahoma. How you doing? My name is Scott Tony Mincy. I'm four-time world champion kickboxer. Yes, because you're only a man and a man's got to learn. This is his dojo. It's one of my favorite learning environments. And this is... My name is Kiana. I'm an eighth grader at Irving Middle School. This guy right here, this menacing fellow, is known as only the Guapo. People don't know about the jab is it's like pouring tea. Like pour, shoot at the camera with me. Pour tea. So it's the same motion as pouring tea. You'll also notice that the same motion is used when a writer takes a pen and puts it to paper. Sure, there are more flashy looking movements, but the jab is fundamentally sound because it's quick, requires little movement and is overall just more effective than the over-the-top acrobatics seen in the movies. However, just like any good teaching and learning technique we use with students in the classroom, the jab requires a lot of time and practice before implementing at full speed. Perfect. And that's a jab, and now that's all I need. That's all I need. I'm going to add that to the writing technique, which is judgment, Authority, basis, and summary. Jab, get it? Get it? Jab. So when breaking apart complex argumentative and informational texts, identify the author's judgment on the topic. Question the authority of experts by writing down details about their background. Are they credible? Record the most important details. This is the author's basis and supports their judgment. Don't forget to summarize their article as a whole so you can reevaluate it later and always compose a stance of your own. Don't forget, a strong stance is supported with credible evidence. Yes, now I can. Okay. Well, not yet. You've got to introduce yourself and tell what school you're from and what grade you're in. Okay, so the jab is effective because it is one of the... See, this is where I'm going to like put it all in. So the jab is the fundamental movements in mixed martial arts, boxing, karate, you name it, anytime you're fighting, because it is effective. My words get This is why I should have written the script. So the jab is effective because it covers it's, the jab is effective because it requires little time to execute. It doesn't need a lot of distance to get to the target. And it's using a variety of mixed martial arts. 